<laughs> now I'm gonna be looking for stuff all week now, so I can make fun of. So if you're one of these people, you might be in the comedy show. Now this is no joke. We have to stop scoochitis. I'm on a worldwide mission to stop scoochitis, scoocheria. You know, it's it's the, the people that wear the shorts that scooch up in the air. We are not gonna have this. I'm a Don't be embarrassing us and all these ports that we go to suffering from scooch items. You can get it out like if you were break dance like age and wish, you can just do a break dance move and get it out without even touching it. Just swallow it like this and it comes down. Hey, look, I'm going to tell you who else. I'm a, they're not at the comedy club, but y'all clap it up for our show band, Chris, the whole show band. They are going to rock all crews. Now, one of them has a hair lip, but don't stare at him because he can't help it because he tried to get the surgery and it almost worked, but the saxophone. <laughs> now, look, I'm coming to the... I'm coming to the uh, Harry Chess Contest because there's always somebody funny in the Harry Chess Contest. Two weeks ago, somebody's grandfather, 85 years old, gets into the Harry Chess Contest and what they do is put on some cool music and have you come down some steps. But well, this man was 85. The ship was moving from side to side, so he's holding on to the banister, coming down. All of us are at the bottom praying like, Please don't let people fall down in front of these people. He gets to the bottom of the steps, pulls out an inhaler, and starts working it up for a good They're screaming, they loved it. And then he did something I've never seen in a hair test contest. He dropped trout. But he had on one of the little short, you know, the um, thong thing, 85. With a thong, it had slack in it. It had slack in it. Kids were crying. I threw up twice. One more time, coming up for me. Thank you guys for coming out. See you tomorrow.